Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Brady Young, and welcome to the third episode of Book Talk from my book, Darkest Light It Begins. Now, I know you might be wondering, while you're doing Book Talk, where's your book? Well, if you watch my announcement video, I announced that I'm able to now sell my books through the store Kohl's here in the city. And I said that I gave three copies. Well, those are my only three remaining copies I had. So I kind of don't have a book here to display. So just envision it here. Or you could go to one of the two links to Amazon to purchase the book. Or for the actual product, you're going to have to buy a paperback. But you can also buy an ebook. So those will be, again, in the description below. So let's jump right in to episode three, which means chapter three, Rise of the Heroes. All right, so chapter two ended on an attack at the school. So naturally, the chapter, we'll move a month ahead. No, I'm just kidding. No. It's, <laughs> chapter three continues with that attack. So the school is attacked by two superhumans that are leading a gang. And again, you guys, remember, I'm not spoiling anything, so I'm being very vague. So if you want to know more, you're going to have to buy it. So during the attack, unfortunately, the two superhumans get away. Unfortunately, because, well, Raphael did reveal who he is. He's still in his, like, costume suit, whatever you'd like to call it. And so the police automatically look at him and go, you're the one that's doing the attack, and they arrest him. That's a bit of a predicament right there. So moving on after that scene in the book, Kane goes home. Everyone's let out from the school. Well, a little while later, Brady, the father of Kane and Elaine, finally starts revealing some stuff about who they are and even more details about who Elaine is. A little while after Brady reveals some stuff, Kane also kind of finds out, I can fly. Like, it's just one of those things where it's like, come on, who wouldn't want to be able to fly it, but he can't fly really well at the beginning. But, again, I'm not going to start revealing some stuff. But he's able to fly and everything, and there's the main task of trying to get Raphael out of prison because, you know, he's being wrongly, wrongly convicted. But because of who Raphael is, he's not going to really get a fair trial. who his alias is. But during, before Raphael actually breaks out, Kane does, well, he stops a crime, and so it's right off the bat, you kind of just see him, even though he's supposed to be going and helping a friend, he's still, like, he's still making time for other people. He's still always being that person, like, you know what, there's something wrong happening, I need to go and do this. Like, he's just that kind of person. With chapter three as well, I also introduced some more parents so it's naturally more characters, which are both supportive and, at times, main. And also within that same scene that I introduced some more of the parents, I'm also introducing some more of the kids that are getting their powers unlocked. Now, because I did talk about on the back of the book, and just to be nice, I will reveal some of those characters that get their powers unlocked. Now, why are those powers locked? You're going to have to read to get that detail. But the kids that get their powers unlocked are Drew... Jane, and Tom. Now the thing about Drew with his powers is, I'm not gonna tell you because that would reveal too much of chapter three, but <laughs> his powers go a little out of control as soon as they're unlocked and he starts rampaging and just creating destruction throughout the city. So naturally, it falls to Cain and Raphael to stop him. So after everything starts calming down, they get everyone back together, they're in this warehouse, and so they, the parents then talk to the kids, and they start discussing some stuff, and so then they present to the kids, well, what would you like to choose as your aliases or your code names or whatever, and so they choose. And again, I'm not going to tell you guys because that's something you're going to have to read. As well as they choose their code names, they also choose a team name. And I'm not going to reveal that either, I'm being very vague with this episode. And as ep further future episodes come on, I'm probably going to be very vague as well. I'm just giving you like certain brief highlights, like little tiny snapshots. So near the end of this chapter, after everything is said and done, after certain things are decided, after they choose and just 
all around talk about what they're going to do. Brady and Kane then discuss and they decide, okay, you know what? We're going on a flight because we're going to go meet some more of my friends. And just because of certain things that are happening. But that is episode three, you guys. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, don't forget to give this video a like. Don't forget to leave a comment down below. And remember to leave a question down below as well for my future Q&A video. And don't forget to subscribe to stay tuned for more, you guys, because I will be bringing you quite a few more videos. And as well, I will be doing two episodes of Book Talk for Dark Side Begins a week. So that's two episodes. So next week, expect chapter four and chapter five. But guys, again, I hope you enjoyed this video as much as I enjoy talking about it and being very vague. So as always, thanks for watching.